Well, hello there. Are you tired of your base getting robbed? Well, no longer. Here is my base. It's a good base. Don't laugh. There's no buttons. There's nothing to alert anyone to the presence of how to get in. But there's a key. And I'm in my base. What say you, you ask? Well, redstone works. It's the same as a torch. But what say if you want to get the item back? Well, there you go. My base. Okay, enough with the advertisement. What we have here is a completely undetectable bud switch. All it is, and in 1.3, mind you, is a dispenser with a water bucket, a boat, and a pressure plate, and a lever. Since the dispenser is being continuously powered, any redstone update will update it and will fire out the water. So, this updates it, but not destroying it. I'm really not sure why. It seems like a bug in the game, possibly. But redstone does it for both. And a torch does it for both. All that is happening is the dispenser is firing water and lifting the boat off the pressure plate. My previous version of this was a lot larger and more annoying due to the sound the pistons made. And it wasn't a T flip flop. It just fired out a two tick pulse. Which has its uses, I guess, if you want that as a use for some reason. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to build one of these. So, we're going to need a boat, a pressure pad, a dispenser, a bucket of water, and let's use... No, let's not use sandstone. Mm, let's use wood planks. dispenser under, put blocks like this, block here, here, pressure pad here, cover this block right here, we will need a lever, although a redstone torch would work as well, but a lever is more, um, resource efficient and we will just put the water in there put the boat there and let's get something just to hmm yeah let's use it redstone lamp so you can see it's on but you update it it floats up you take it off it updates it goes back down it floats up. It stays floating up. And it goes back down. Like I said, um, this is, or like I hope I said, this is uh, designed by Natavisions, this T flip flop. You should go check it out. I'll provide the link in the description. Um, but I believe I'm the, I discovered the use for uh, undetectable bud switch in this manner. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed this little tutorial, and thanks for watching.